This is question 80 from the 2016 exam. So here in this question, we have a car traveling on a, a fairground ride with an initial speed of five meters per second, height eight meters above the ground. Then it goes down up a bit to a point called Y, two meters above uh, the ground where it travels with, with a speed of nine meters per second. We're supposed to calculate the work done by resistive forces or the energy lost to resistive forces during this uh, short descent. So the energy the car has at uh, the point X will be some gravitational potential energy and some kinetic energy. And so it weighs 200 kilos, that's one more important thing. This is what we get when we substitute the numbers, 200 kilos, 8 meters, 200 kilos again, and 5 meters per second, which yields 18,500 joules. So that's the total energy it has uh, on top of the track. And now some of it it will lose to uh, resistive forces, and some of it it will keep as some potential energy and kinetic energy. So again, for EY, that's MGH, or gravitational potential energy, and the kinetic energy. But this time, that has to equal to the previous energy at X, minus the work done by the resistive forces. This is what it looks like with all the numbers plugged in, and that gives us that the work done by the resistive forces, or the energy loss to the resistive forces, is 6,400 joules, which is the correct answer, and in the exam, it was option B.